Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to my new favourite game at the moment. <laughs> so this is my second, my second go up playing this game. So uh, just really, really thoroughly enjoying it. I've added a couple of little mods in and things, but we'll just see how it goes. Also, massive shout out to Chris Paul who donated the money to buy all the DLC for the game. Also, there was another guy I can't remember his name, but I will find out. Big shout out to them too, so massive shout out to you. I got all the DLC. I didn't get the Jeep one, but I just I don't I didn't really need it. Right. So this is where I left off. So we're gonna finish this today. So we'll get the engine in. I've got the back ends, I think. Yeah, the back end's not being rebuilt, so. That needs doing today. I got this at auction, uh, which is a drift car. I just spotted it. It's a 180 SX. It's a mod, but it's a, it is a 180 SX full roll cage in, and you can change all the bumpers on it and everything. So I think it's pretty cool. Obviously needs a lot of work, but yeah. Then I also got this at the junkyard. Uh, Obviously, there's not much left, but yeah, there's not much here. But uh, I'm pretty sure it's a nice car. Uh, I think we'll make sure just take that seat out. Right, so yeah, that's what we're dealing with today. Uh, also, while I'm here, uh, I want to show. I bought a few cars out in the car park, so we'll go and have a look at them. I, I need to stop buying cars. To be, We've got absolutely hundreds of cars and, uh, and not enough time to actually build them. So I really need to stop buying cars, but at the moment I'm just really enjoying it. Right, so uh, that's our spare Clio that we've got, which I will... Can you sell these? probably can but yeah so I'll be selling this I bought it purely just for the wheels uh, I've got a Clio in the paint booth I bought this at auction in between the last episode and now uh, it was a mod it was just to see if it worked it's an M3 it's an old E30 uh, again needs a bit of work nothing drastic though because it's I mean it's fairly clean but definitely wants an engine rebuild then I got the Hoonigan Mustang, look at this beast. This is a mod. This needs fully restorating, but uh, it's pretty cool looking at it. So yeah, I've got that from the junkyard. Uh, got this. <laughs> Bought loads, haven't I? Jesus. Yeah, so this is now 34, I think. So I think this is going to be my next build. Uh, I'm, I'm interested to work on that. I've got this truck as well. Little uh, little flatbed, nothing uh, nothing drastic. It's not that bad. I got that at auction actually. I got a uh, Mercedes racing truck. <laughs> Everyone needs one of them. Then I got a pretty much a non-turbo standard 240 as well. Well, it's a 180 SX, but you know. So I picked that up at the junkyard as well. So I don't know what I'm going to do yet with that, but yeah, I'm fairly happy with that. All right. Uh, I need to swap the wheels over on this Clio, so this can go back to the garage. Your garage can only handle up. All oh, right, okay. All right, we've got too many cars in the garage. <laughs> I am going to go and buy some more cars today, but uh, I really need to work on the RX-7. Desperately need to work on the RX-7. Uh, it's not that new, you know, it's, it's out, it's on Steam, it's been out for ages, it's just, it's, I, I've never had it before, and I, I love it, I'm, I'm like, so addicted to it. I don't know if you guys can hear my voice okay. Right. Ah, that was my first ever car built. I've actually got uh, some modifications I can do on that now, but uh, what we'll do is we'll shift that out of the garage for now. Send that to car park. 
Alright, I really need this lift clear, so if I get rid of... Nah, if I stick that over there... Oh, look at that! Take a supercharge V8! Monster! Can't wait to start working on that 240. Right, so I need to go out and grab that Cleo. Hey, Chris. I just I don't know if you heard, but I gave you a bit of a shout out at the start of the uh, at the start of the episode. There, just I, I got all the DLC, so thank you. Uh, I will go. I'm going to go to the scrapyard later and look for some more cars, but I don't need any at the moment. Uh, Right, so I, d I desperately want to work on this R34, and I want to work on this as well, but uh, we've just got too many cars. Right, so I'm going to ship this back to the garage, and then we'll get rid of it, because I only want the wheels off it. I need one wheel off it, but I need to put both Cleos on the lift, so I can take one wheel off, one wheel back on. It's a bit of a chew on, to be honest, but... Uh, I subbed earlier, your voice is fine. Uh, late night stream with Mark. Uh, what could go wrong? Oh, Jack. I'm gonna like, I'm gonna hunt Jack down one day. <laughs> uh, didn't I send that to the garage? What? I thought I sent it to the garage. Right, this needs to go on the left. Why do I keep shutting myself in? So, where's that Cleo gone? Right, so I'll tell you what. I'll stick that. Uh, no, not that one. So I'll stick that back in the I'll stick that one in the paint booth for now and I need to go and grab this clear. Where's it gone? Feel free to hunt me down. <laughs> How are you doing, Lee? You're alright, no worries mate, I like the game but uh, it won't play I know. I know. I mean I've got that with PUBG and I've also got a set of courses on that computer and I can't stream it. Drifted. It just won't stream. Right, so I want to move. There we go. Right, feel free. No, I'm going to go and work on the RX7, uh, but I just want to get to the Clio sorted because I've got two Clios at the moment I don't need them both I need to start getting rid of cars because I'm going to go to the scrapyard today and I'm going to buy more because <laughs> uh, yeah why not life's great and that right uh, right so we'll shift that to that lift right so all I need I want this back wheel off This wheel's too bad to be repaired. Uh, so uh, what I'm, the plan is to take one of these. Alright, so yeah, I can put that one back on. Right, so that Cleo now can go. So does anyone know how to sell a car? That one's not. Nah, don't need it. Next ETS2 stream tomorrow. Yeah, dogs are okay. My wife will be in soon, so... Right, so how, how do I overview? Is that how I sell it? No. Car status, sell car. 14,000. Good, done. Right, so that's that one done. 
So I've got a wheel to do for this one. Uh, so we need to separate the parts, which are there. Pretty much guaranteed an ETSMP stream every night at nine, yep. And then a single player stream you're pretty much guaranteed as well. Uh, every day, so farming, I'm, I'm, I'm annoyed I didn't get any farming out today, but you know, what can you do? I wouldn't mind having a look at that 240 today if we get time, but uh, <laughs> I, I don't think we're going to get time. Uh, I think we're just putting uh, we'll just put the old tyres back on it eh, for now. How much is car mechanic 18? Uh, nine and a half pound. Who was telling me about truck mechanic? Someone's been talking about truck mechanic all day. Who was telling me about it? Can anyone remember? This is kind of relaxing. Yeah, well, I've got, I'm gonna go and start stripping the back end of this down. We need to rebuild the back end of this, and then I need to put the engine in this lovely clean beer. Uh, but I just want to get this clear out of the way first because I'm not going to have time to to do anything on it major. I'm not going to have time to strip the engine and all that, but I, I want to work on it. Uh, but it's it's a clean body now. So, and it's got, uh, at least it's got four matching wheels now. Ah, there we go. I'll, I'll end up changing the wheels anyway, eventually. But uh, that's what I wanted, so I'm going to shove that back in the paint booth now. It's looking alright, isn't it? So the next job for that is to be painted. Truck mechanic i seen on Steam, uh, but it's from 15. Yeah, uh, well, it's seven and a half pound, or eight pound, I think it was. I went on Kingwin just now, and it was 89 pence, so I bought it. So I will, I will have a look at that. Uh, and see, see how see how good it is. It might be good for the truck lads. They might enjoy it, you know. Right. Right, you. Oh no, I don't. I don't want to take stuff out of it. Hang on. No, what are you doing? That's the one. I think I also took a side skirt off it by mistake as well. Is there a side skirt missing off this side? Yes, there is. I'm liking this. I don't know why I'm liking it so much, but I so want to start work on this car. <laughs> right. Uh, so, I'll stick that on lift C for now. Out the road. This wants to go in the paint and shop. And we're good. So that's us for now, until we go and have a nosy around the uh, the auction room. I also want to bring that R32 in today as well. I really just shouldn't be doing anything, should I? Alright. Let's start work on the old RX7. So. Let's strip the back end out. Trying to work out what comes off first, you know, it's, it's nice when you, there's so many different cars in. I'm interested to go to the scrapyards because I've got mods in now as well, so I'm interested to go to the scrappy. Let me know in the in the chat if you think we should go to the scrapyard. For a walkabout. I promise I won't buy any cars. Scrapyard for walkies, yes, 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 excellent. All right, we'll just strip this back end down and we're off to the scrappy. I love going to the scrapyards, great. 
got the ideas of the best days. Uh, I just heard my headset dying already. That's not a good start for the stream, is it? I haven't charged it for like two days. Can't wait to rebuild the back end. It's, it looks horrible. Looks so good when you rebuild it. We rebuilt the front fairly quick, do you remember? Can't believe I only started building this car today. Got a full engine to go in it and everything. All built. Like with a camera, that's that's the only thing I've had, I've had at the moment. Is trying to work out what you're meant to be doing with a camera. Right, I will reach out. You just need to bear with it. How's things, uh, Jimmy, mate? Really good, mate. Yeah. Uh, did you sort your sound issue? Yeah, it wasn't me. It was YouTube. So, the, once my video was uploaded, so during the live stream, it, the sound would be really distorted. Once the live stream was over, uh, the, the sound would then undistort itself and, all, and sound fine. So it was actually, it was actually YouTube's problem. Uh, in, the in, in the sound encoding, I think it was. But it's all sorted now. Hey, right, that's the rear end of the drift. Done. I don't think there's out else up here. No, that's fine. So when we come back from the scrapper, you will need to work on the rear end. Now, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to throw the engine in while I'm here. Uh, we are working at lift A, is what we're working at. Uh, what's this? Um. Alright, that's the motor in, she's in. Right, I'm going to the scrapyard. Uh, am I the only one that liked the stream so far? Uh, you totally won't spend money at the scrapyard. Exactly, that's what I'm thinking. I went to the scrapyard, I found a turbo in one of the cars. Uh, it's still brand new. I put it on my shelf. Uh, ha, bloody hell. I won't buy cars, says Mark. Comes back with 10. I don't think I'll buy 10. I think 10's probably a bit. I love the scrapyard. I went to car auctions as well, right? Just on my own. Well, I wasn't streaming. And uh, and it's just not the same. Like, the cars need a bit of TLC. But scrapyard, you know, you get not, your cars need so much work. But I'm never going to have time. I've got about 40 in storage. I'm never going to actually get all 40 fixed. I might buy anything from a scrapyard, uh, like giving your missus a uh, credit card and say don't spend much yet. Die exactly. Right, what's about? What the hell's that? Oh, I don't need that. I'm not interested in that at all. I've got to be honest, lads, it's actually looking fairly empty, the scrapyard. There's not much here at all, car-wise. Wow. There's nothing. There's that. This is useless to nobody. 
Oh, I might have to nip to the auctions and see if we can get a deal. God, there's an out. That was a worst scrapyard visit, yeah? It's empty because they're all in your garage. That, that's a possibility. Uh, no dish on your bank tonight. Uh, yeah, exactly. Uh, best find in the scrapyard. What has been your best find? The 240. Uh, no, no, the R34. I would say I've got an R34 in, in the garage. Uh, that's probably my best find. Uh, the 240 I actually bought from an auction, so... This truck's gonna be nice when I actually put a body on it. This'll be, I'm telling you now, that is low as out, that's gonna look nice, that. Right, we're off, uh, I'm gonna go to the auctions. I'm annoyed! I searched the name of the turbo, it was 5,000, I'm not selling it. I would sell it. <laughs> I wouldn't really. I wish my PC would run the game. I've been surprised. This PC is not good. not the best at all, but it, it runs really, really well. I don't think we're going to get much. I've got a funny feeling. <laughs> I've already got one of them. Race truck. I've got one of them as well. I've got too many cars. I'm getting the game tomorrow. I don't blame you. Honestly, it, it really, really surprised me. Already got an M3. I wanted something I didn't already have. Is this game... It's... it's fun it, it's it's addictive it is heavily addictive it's i mean it really is i'm just i'm not even actually achieving anything at the moment i should be back at the garage building cars but buying them so addictive nah there's nothing just bought a set of cars awesome buddy i hope you enjoy it mate i think i've bought all the cars <laughs> Yeah, I, th I think you might be right, right. We better, we better crack on with the RX-7. I might bring the R32, the R34 in and start that as well. I might also start the 180. Should I, finish, should I finish one project at a time? Or should I just do whatever I fancy? Right. There's not much left of this thing, is there? Finish one at a time, you reckon? See, my problem is, is I hate them sitting there looking awful. Do you know what I mean? That's my problem. They're sitting here just looking disgusting and annoying me. Right. I don't know how stanced I want it yet, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go with the idea of buying everything and then I can choose what I fancy. I think this is quite a good idea. There's a lot of stuff for this C10, isn't there? Jesus Christ. I'll sell what I don't need, like, I just, I don't know what I fancy. I don't know what style I want to go with it yet. I know I definitely want to run aftermarket stuff on it. Why is there so many parts? I don't need any of them. Cabs. That's what I need. You can run a flatbed with it. Oh, I can do farm truck like straight outlaws. Oh, I'm going, I'm going farm truck style. Uh, 
Right, uh, for the BM, uh, E30 old things who have... Yeah, I, I've got the E30, I've got a blue one. Uh, I can show you it after if you want. Right, so I'm going to go custom hood on it. I'm sick of this thing looking awful. Right, so we're going to go stock uh, plastic front fenders. Stock trim removed. So we'll go with that. We'll go with them lights because I like them. Stop removed, excellent. Did I put a light in that? Right, cab. I want to go for the beta cab, I think. I really do. The long body, I like that. Uh, that doesn't really fit, does it? Hang on. I can't run them. Oh, that was a nice body, that as well. Right, it's going to need to be... Sunbeam back, there we go. That's, that's not the right one, is it? What's the one I need then? I don't think that's the right one, you know. Why is it so small? So I put the wrong back end on, is that the problem? Ah, there she is. That's the one I wanted. She's definitely looking better at that, I tell you. I'll go for the chrome rear back end. Uh, did I buy any lights for it? I'm not bothered about lights at the minute. I just don't want it looking terrible. Alright. Tinted trim removed. We'll go with that. We'll go for the... Can I fit them on? Oh, you can. Nice. Oh, yeah, I haven't put a front end on this yet. Uh, I'm going to go with that one. Smart. It's going to run chrome front bumper for now. Stock trim removed and. That one, right. So that's her looking a bit tidier. So I'll throw her on the in the paint booth once I've finished. Oh, I can't wait to drive that thing. How nice is that? Right. Let's get back to the RX-7. Uh, right, why do you uh, have... Oh, what? Why do you have... A helmet on the table behind you. Uh, it's just, yeah, it's just, oh, it's just for sure. It's got all my wheels in it, and yeah, it's just, just to look nice. And then I've got a shelf with a load of models and things up above it as well. So yeah, it's just, just for sure. I can never ride a motorbike, so I love the helmet as well. So, all right, we need to go to the repair table. Got to do. I mean, I don't know what you mean by powerful PC, because I mean, I don't have that. It's not that powerful. Uh, this PC is not that powerful, and it, it is doing a lot. Uh, Alright, where's the rear end? I am going to need to buy some parts, I'm quite aware of that. Right, we're alright at the moment. I'm 
Haven't got many big bearings left. I wouldn't mind getting this back on its feet again today. If I could get this car running in this episode, but I, I know I know I won't because I'll end up going by and other things. I know what I'm like. Right, so I need... Right, I've got one of them. Do I need a hub and that? We're all right for one hub. I'll put on what I can and then... We'll see. Right, so I need definitely need one of them. Need a one of them as well. Start writing a shopping list, I think. Right, so we need definitely need rotors, which I know that anyway. Exhaust pipe, done. Middle muffler, done. Cap, done. So many parts needed. Can we put the. Uh... Ah, we've got plenty of wheel bearings though. What's the drive shaft like? Drive shaft's good. Plenty of small bearings. Got one of them as well. So this side's probably going to be built. I would say. Oh, I'm going to need some suspension for it because I won't have any springs. I know I won't. Yeah, no springs, right? That's right. Add that on. Obviously, I'll just buy two of everything. Right, so we'll go with that and we'll go and get some stuff ordered. This is a complicated game. I mean, I'm not playing it properly. To be to be honest, I'm cheating because I'm cheating the money. I'm just I'm just enjoying building cars. Uh, purely and simply, that's all it is. So yeah, technically, I'm not playing it properly, but uh, I, I'm enjoying myself. Right, rear, uh, rear arm. Right, so we need an arm. Right, so I'm going to go for two of these because I'm going to assume I need two. Right, then we need a rear shock here. So I'll put shock in. We need rear shock here. We'll definitely need two of them. Definitely. Uh, right, rear. I'm going to need spring. I know I need one of them and I need a uh, rear spring times two. All right, then I need a disc. Times two. Uh, I'll be in there next, won't we? Right, so I need a cat. I need a middle muffler. For some reason I believe the middle mufflers are down here. Middle muffler, I need an exhaust pipe, whichever one just the exhaust pipe is, which is that one. Uh, and the cat. Did I get the cat? Yeah, I did, yeah. Right, so we should be alright at that. For now, we'll need, we'll, need, we'll need to go and order more parts, I know we will. Didn't get any brake pads. Oh, I've already got some in, that'll do. Mark, I think you're more comfortable on your desk. Uh, I mean, it is comfortable. The rigs, rigs aren't really built for, you know, they're never going to compete against the desk, but... Uh, at least you're enjoying yourself. Exactly. Uh, I'm feeling great today. Again, I, I feel a little bit bad because I know I shouldn't really be playing this game for so long. Uh, and I, I should be playing other things, but... 
that, that, that we've been playing for ages, but I will go back to them, you know, in the next day or two. I just, when you get a new game, you just want to play it, you know? I'd be lying if I was sitting playing somewhere else and saying I, I, I didn't want to go and play this. I would just be absolutely lying. Right, so, shopping list time again. I'm going to delete all that, so we need one of them. I need a good few of them. Uh, I know I need another set of brake pads for the other side. Uh, I need two of them mounts. Uh, we'll go with that. This RX-7 will be done fairly sharpish, actually. I mean, it'll be a bit to do on the uh, on the engine to get it actually running, I think. But uh, I know I don't need. Swear bar. What do I need? Swear bar B. I'm going to assume I'm going to need two of them. Oh no, I didn't mean to come out of the shop. Hang on. Right, uh, shopping list. So I've got a swear bar B, a uh, rubber bush. So if we do bush, I bought 10 last time, so we'll just buy 10 this time and 10 of them. Because we're using these all the time, we're doing that many cars, it's just, they're not, they're not going to waste. Uh, and then we need a cap, rear shop cap. Alright, so that's the back end not far off being done, to be honest. Alright. Obviously, I've got the other side to do. Thought I, I thought I ordered the rear swear bar, did I not? Oh, did I order this front one? Must have ordered the front. What an idiot. I've still got bushes to fit as well. Alright, so that's this side done. Built. Alright, so I need to build this side now. I've got the... Uh Put these bushes in first because I bought some now. How are we doing in chat? Uh, Mark, I'm off, mate. Take care, mate. Yeah, actually, really enjoy this. Uh, thought I wouldn't like watching it because it looked a bit complicated, but it's pretty chill. I I'm pretty chilled anyway. How long are you staying tonight? It's uh, 10 to 1, or are you going to like 20 past again? I, I honestly don't know. Uh, to be honest, Saturdays are going to become a late night day for me because my wife's at work till late, so I'm not keeping her awake by streaming, do you know what I mean? So she's happy that I'm on. Uh, she, I don't even think she's home yet, so uh, yeah, at the end of the day. Oh no, I need, I need a new one of them. Yeah, at the end of the day, I'm just I'm just enjoying myself, you know, I really am. Right, so I need one of them. So yeah, I would say more Saturdays I'll probably be on till about half past one, I think. But I don't know yet, because we're not there yet. Right, we need quite a few bits for this side. Oh, hang on. I didn't delete the stuff off the shopping list. Right, I'll add that to the basket. I'll add one of them. I'll add one of them as well. I'll put on what I can while I'm here. Alright. 
shopping list again. God. Uh, Right, so I need a. I definitely need all of them. I need a rear, rear axle knuckle A. I need an, another upper arm, which is rear suspension arm B. And I need that one. But I need the bottom one as well, though. There's a rear suspension arm here. I've got the upper arm, where's the air arm at? I'm being absolutely blind here. Should be us. Oh no, I think I need. Oh, I bought the wrong one. Hang on. Ah, what did I do? Alright, where are we at with this? So, front wheel axle. I know I need one of them. Why do I need what's a hub three? Hang on. Apparently, ah, there we go. That's what I need. Ah. I should really start selling all the old bits, you know. Right. So now we'll be able to put the drive shaft in. Uh, drive shaft. Oh, wheel bearing. Get that in. Uh, drive shaft. There we go. Bob's your uncle in that. Set of pads on. Caliper. Oh, right, we need a new caliper. Hang on, I can still, uh, I can still put the spring and all that on, no camera. Put these arms and all that on. Spring on, upper arm. Sarek 7 is going to be done in no time, looking pristine. I'm keeping it as well, I'm not even going to sell it, I'm not going to mess about with it, I just I want to keep it looking nice. Right, so I need a caliper. Done. So we can uh, chuck on the exhaust. Uh, have we got a muffler? No. Well, we have got one, but it's broken. So I need a muffler. I've got that bit. I've got that bit. We don't have an up. Do we have a downpipe? No. Alright, so I need that bit. Oh, gearbox, that'll be handy, wouldn't it? I better put the gearbox somewhere over here.
Alright, so I need a drive shaft. Handy. Alright, this stuff I can only do from the top. I know that for me. Alright, so back to the shop. Uh, we've been attempting. Uh, it looks like uh, you can paint all the parts uh, when you fit them. You have colour choice. Yeah, I, see, I don't know how you can paint them though. That's what I'm saying. Like, I think you can. But also, I don't know if you can. I know it sounds ridiculous, but I'm trying to see if I can find a piece that's uh, that I can just take off to show you. I've got nothing on here that I can just take off to show you, but yeah, you you can't choose the colour. Is the problem? Hello. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. What time did you want me to finish? Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Uh, I'll, I'll, get, I'll get it. What, what did you get me? I'll get it in about half hour. Right, I'll come off now. I've only been on like half an hour. Right, hang on. I'll come downstairs. Right, uh, when you put the caliper on, uh, colour choice icon thing. Yeah, it does it with every part. Right, look, I'll show you. Yeah, uh, right. just in case I'm doing something right and uh, something wrong and someone can show me. So like if I put that caliper on there, but he does it with all parts as well, like all these parts here. And I'm, I, I was interested to see if you could paint them. Yeah, see the colour there, but you can't. It won't let you change your colour. Uh, a red caliper would be neat. But yeah, ev every part has that. That colour icon there, and it just comes up as white, but I don't know. I don't know how to how to paint it, you know. Right, we'll just stick this back on anyway. But yeah, if anyone knows how to paint the items, let me know in the future. That'll be great. Right, so I was going shopping one. That's what I was doing. Yeah, I tried pressing the different mouse buttons, but I uh, couldn't get anything right. So I need a starter. V8. Did I just buy two? I might have just bought two. So I need the... Uh, need the front part of the exhaust, the ROT. So what's it say? Front exhaust. So front section. Our ROT is obviously for rotary. Right, so one of them got the starter. Uh, drive shaft. We need uh, just that one. Then we need the rear muffler. So muffler. I just need the rear rear muffler V8 apparently. That's all. All right. Right, 
Right, so I'll stick that on. See all the parts you put on. See the colour. It's weird. I, I would paint all the parts, me. That all needs to be done from the bottom, so that's that's that side of it done. Ah, as far as you know, you can't change it, right? I, I did, I did, I did think that, like. So, all right, stick a battery in. We haven't got an air radiator, so we'll need to order one. We'll delete our existing shopping list. Air filter base, I'd rather just buy another one. Break by a servo, probably got a spare one kicking about, which I do. Oil filter, uh, fuel filter. Right, fuel rail. Done. In. Intake manifold. Shall be good. One. I don't have the throttle, I don't think, no. Nearly got me RX7 finished. Right, ready. They may have come out of there. Alright, so the air filter base that one and then the air filter ROT here which is that one I'll probably need the top as well but I'd rather just get this bit done first didn't get the throttle housing did I because I forgot I also bought the wrong fan housing for it So, add to list. And then I put the throttle on the list. Thought I did. I'm not really using the list, if I'm going to be honest. <laughs> right, uh, right, we may as well get the top of the air filter wire here. Uh, air filter cover, that's that one. So that's one thing done. Uh, so we need to read the... that one I need now I need fan one fan two so that one and that one and then I need the throttle all right so I'm gonna assume it's that one there we go Got any clips? Oh, we do. Uh... Alright, how we doing here? How are you tonight? Have you to go soon? Yeah, my wife brought my tea in for me because obviously I didn't eat because there was no one here. So, my wife's brought my food in for me, so I'm being very rude by not going and getting it. So, I just wanted to get this bit done, but I've got all day tomorrow. I won't be playing this tomorrow, that's the only downside. Because uh, we've got other games to play, unfortunately. I'm 
I'm assuming there's something to go on the end of it, no? He's full. Right, uh, all right, so we're all good with that. Uh, I'm off my yet. Uh, spent time playing months ago. Yeah, I know. I, I was. I'm absolutely addicted to it. Like, fantastic. All right, so I need a. Uh, Fuel tank. I don't have one. Right, so fuel tank, uh, pump. I can't remember if I put the starter on this one or not. I hope so because I forgot the starter on the other one. Uh, I'll probably test drive it tomorrow. I can't actually remember whether I put the. I can't remember whether I put the starter on or not. I'm pretty sure I have. We bought a V8 start. No, I haven't. There you go. So I need to do the starter from underneath. I mean, if I could start the car, I'd be happy. I was gonna do one car uh, and spent like five hours. Yeah, I know. I know that feeling. Right, we bought the V8 one. There we go. I mean, she probably should start that unless I've clearly missed something. But we built this from nothing. Right, which is pretty cool. It's looking nice, isn't it? Question is, will it start? Oh, she's perfect. Excellent. Got the interior to do tomorrow. RX-7 is built. So the next one that I'm going to tackle uh, on the stand is this bad boy. This will be tomorrow's task. Excellent. Right. Sorry about the short episode, but there's nearly an hour, so you can't argue with that. And uh, yeah, I'll catch you all uh, tomorrow. Big shout out to everybody for uh, supporting me today. I've had a great day. Really, really enjoyed myself. And uh, yeah, other than that, I better disappear before I get wrong. <laughs> and uh, yeah, thanks again, guys. I'll see you all for normal gameplay tomorrow. I might do a little bit of this. I don't know. I'm really enjoying it. So see you later, guys. Take care and thanks again.